in March 2023, I uploaded my first YouTube shot. And after a couple of videos, I can say it has personally changed my life. I started using YouTube in 2018, not as a content creator, but a consumer. Without YouTube, I don't think I would have been able to graduate successfully as a pharmacy student. I understood most of my pharmacy courses because of several YouTube videos that I watch. This really inspired me to also have a YouTube channel, but I never started because of these four main reasons. One, I was very poor at editing. I didn't know anything about editing and I never believe I can be good at editing. Two, I was so concerned about what others would say. I was worried about what others would say because I had other friends who also started their channel and I remember the comments that I used to give about their channel. The third reason is I was so concerned about not having the right equipment, right gears, right camera, professional microphone and lastly lack of confidence. I was so shy. Anybody who has known me knows that I wasn't a social media person making videos like I am doing now. I'm so sure many of us can relate. Probably yours is not starting a YouTube channel. Yours is starting a business, starting a new relationship, quitting your job. But you have not started because of several reasons. And I don't call them reasons. I call them excuses. But trust me, just start before you are ready. Yes, my first YouTube video was a YouTube short. And it was a motivational video. It was a video, not for anyone, but for myself. Hello, lovely people. The message today is, you are born great. Don't look down upon yourself. Believe in yourself because you are born great. I was motivating myself not to look down upon myself because I am born great and I have all the qualities to be a YouTuber or content creator. I was able to upload my first video after I learned that YouTube has introduced a new feature called YouTube Shorts. And with YouTube Shorts, all I needed was my phone, an internet, pressing record and pressing send to make a video. And after that, I uploaded my first video video my second video was also a motivational youtube shot not for anyone but for myself telling myself to just stop wishing to be good at editing and go to youtube and start learning how to edit hello lovely people the message today is arise it is about time to stop just wishing and arise and do something. Arise. Whilst I was meditating using YouTube Shorts, I was in a big dilemma. I didn't really know what kind of videos my channel would be about. I asked myself these questions. What kind of skill or knowledge do I have or do I know now? I knew I wasn't good at so many skills, but I realized that I had an unfair advantage and that an unfair advantage is I have lived in China for five good years and I knew all the experiences life in China. Therefore, I came up with an idea that my channel would be EQ where the first E means educate, the second E is to entertain, and the last E is to edify. I wanted to educate and edify the world about China because before coming to China, I knew so little about China and besides, China was never an option. I also had an American dream. 
After coming to China and realizing how advanced and developed China was, I was like, wow, probably there are so many people who were just like me before coming to China, knowing so little about China, knowing that 30 years ago China, how China is still poor and not rich and advanced as it is now. I also wanted to entertain the world. That is why I have my most watched or viewed video as this. I never knew about this term in psychology called delayed gratification until I got disappointed after several people close to me were not supporting my channel, were not subscribing or commenting to my videos anytime I shared links of my videos. If you're a beginner, stop expecting so much from the people close to you because you might be disappointed. Most of your support will be strangers. Delayed gratification is all about not expecting so much views or subscribers immediately you upload videos. Just keep on uploading videos and with time you will get so much view or subscribers. Believe me, it was so hard shooting videos, editing them, uploading videos only to end up with 50 views, 100 views as a postgraduate student in China. I wanted to give up after having less than 500 subscribers and few views until I got an email message. And guess what? That email message was a brand deal. I was so surprised I got a brand deal with less than 500 subscribers and I got that brand deal after I uploaded a video which I got only 200 views and that video was about international student dormitory in China. After I made that video, I got a brand deal from an Indian company in several countries like US, Canada, Australia called Amber. And that brand, they help international students get accommodation. I will leave a link to that video of that brand deal for you to check it out. After getting that brand deal, I wrote down two meditations for my channel. One is I would never worry about getting subscribers and views. Two, I will only make videos for the people that video can be valuable even if it's one person that that video can be useful to then i have made it so i decided to build a system for my channel after i watched one of ali abdal's video where he talked about building system for his youtube channel in fact without building systems i don't think i would have been this consistent with my channel. Building system has really helped me to enjoy the process because editing is not something I really enjoy even though I can edit videos. Getting an editor has really saved me in so many ways and it has made the process so easy and so enjoyable. Building system has also helped me to now have three separate channels. In building systems, I got a coach and that coach advised me to have three separate channels after he went through all my videos. He realized that I had three separate niche and that is why I have three separate channels now. That is Dark Spam, which is all about lifestyle in China and Two Side Hustle with Dax, which is about importation from China everything about importing from china without using an agent and the third one is 
campus life in China, about scholarships in China without using an agent studying in China, and also interviewing people who have lived in China for so many years to share their experience with the world. And in fact, that is something I never imagined I could have managed. But with the help of building a system and getting a coach, I now have three separate channels which I am running and I'm being able to be consistent. Starting a YouTube channel has changed my life in so many ways I never imagined. YouTube has gotten me two brand deals so far. YouTube has helped me acquire so many skills. One, I'm now good at editing videos, even though I don't enjoy it. Two, I'm good at graphic designs, designing thumbnails with Canva. I've learned that and now I can design several, several things. I'm also good at public speaking, even though I still need improvement, but I'm better than before. And I'm also no more shy camera in fact youtube has brought the world to me because of youtube i have several friends from all over the world if you are watching me comment in the comment section and let me know which country you are watching me from wish me well on this journey by subscribing to my channel like to this video and stay tuned for more videos by hitting on the notification bell so that you can get a message from this channel. My name is Dax. I'm a master's pharmacy student in China. I also deal in importation and exportation from China. If you want to know anything about importing from China, check on my other channel, Side Hustle with Dax, and I can't wait to have you. If you are thinking of starting your YouTube channel, start before you are ready just start and stop wishing see you for more videos bye bye